Hello everybody, this is Bui from Mama Bui's Kitchen. I hope you are having a great day. In today's video guys, we are going to talk about different kinds of salt that I use with my recipes. So guys, let's get started. Okay, we'll start with iodized salt or table salt. This is probably the most common type of salt and the kind you use to fill your salt shakers. The reason it's called iodized is because most manufacturers fortify the salt with mineral iodine. So I don't use it guys. <laughs> it has a clean salt taste that dissolves quickly. Most people use it for cooking and baking. So that one is a no-no for me. The next salt we're gonna talk about is flaky sea salt. This salt is harvested from shallow ponds, salty sea water, and is irregularly shaped with unique, large, flat, square crystals that gives food a beautiful look and crunchy finish. I like to use it on grilled steak, chocolate chips, and brownies. It works best as a finishing salt. And it's a yes for Mama Bui's kitchen. Next salt is sea salt. This salt is made using evaporated seawater. It generally has larger and coarser crystals than table salt. I like to use it in baked goods, especially cookies, chocolate-based dessert, and sprinkling it on roasted vegetables and it's a yes in my kitchen. Next salt is kosher salt. This salt got its name because it is used when preparing kosher meat. It has larger, coarser crystals than regular salt. This is my go-to salt. I use it on everything, guys, because of its milder flavor and lack of additives. And the brand I use is real salt ancient kosher salt is unrefined you can buy it online and it's a yes in my kitchen the next salt we're gonna talk about is the himalayan pink salt this salt is harvested in the foothills of the himalayan mountains it gets its pink color from the amount of minerals it contains particularly iron is generally more expensive than regular salt but also considered healthier and more pure i like to use it as a finishing salt it adds texture and pops out flavor best used for seasoning meats salads soups and vegetables you may need a grinder for finer size and when you season food use a smaller amount and gradually add more as needed and it's a yes for mama bui's kitchen i hope you enjoyed this video give it a like subscribe until next time guys bye honey for my heart